Omar, a week ago, uh, this would have got you into big trouble and would have gotten the university into big trouble. What does this mean for you as a businessman and a booster? Well, it means a lot. Um, College Hunts was born out of a business plan contest at University of Miami where Derek actually plays, and it was a $10,000 check. Uh, so kind of to go full circle, a week ago, a college athlete wouldn't have been able to take part in the same thing that I did. Um, and I believe that everyone has the right to be an entrepreneur. Um, nobody should prevent anyone from being able to monetize, whether it's their personal brand, their business, um, or whatever else that is that they want to do. Um, so this is extremely exciting. I think it ushers in a new era of entrepreneurship that we haven't necessarily seen before. Um, it's going to connect brands with student athletes. Um, and it's going to really just help, I think, raise the bar for everyone, the yeah. athlete, the brand, and the fan. Right. Derek, tell me how you think this would have changed your recruiting process had it been in effect when you were coming out of high school. Yeah, I definitely think it, it would have affected it. You know, I mean, obviously football is the main goal. It's the main objective to, you know, be on a good team and be in the best position possible for football. But if you can get both, you know, living in Miami, I can get both playing for, you know, a great university. And plus also capitalize on my name. Um, it definitely would have affected, you know, my college decision. Omar, are you worried at all, big picture, that this might uh, help bigger schools more because they have more money, bigger boosters, and more of these endorsement type deals to attract the bigger and better athletes? No, I don't. University of Miami is an 8,000 person school in Coral Gables. I think this sort of ushers in a new level of entrepreneurship. Um, I think it's going to take hustle. I think there's going to be some uncertainty that we have to figure out. But at the end of the day, being a business person, uh, it's all about uncertainty. So I think um, this is what's deserved. This is what's right. I believe the student athlete will now be able to carry their own destiny and uh, be able to learn about business and be able to sort of apply uh, these business principles that they're learning about in school in the real world. Mm. Derek, what are you going to do with all that money? Save it. I don't, <laughs> really? I don't plan on Yeah, I, I, don't, I mean, I don't want to, I don't, I don't know. Um, I just want, I think I'm going to save the majority of it. I'm not a big spender. So that's, that's that. Well, you know, you're going to have to pick up the tab when you go out with your buddies. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see your you while we have you. There it is. All right. Yes, De'Ara King, quarterback for the University of Miami.